In this video, I'm going to be going over Mistral Large 2, which is the latest model from Mistral, which just came out on the heels of the Llama 3.1 and the 405 billion parameter model that Meta AI put out yesterday. And Mistral Large is a really impressive model for a number of reasons. Its context window is 128,000, just like Llama 3.1. And similar to Llama 3.1, it's also trained on a number of specific languages. So in this case, instead of, I believe it's eight in the case of Llama 3.1, this is trained on dozens of languages. And in addition to that, it's specifically trained on more than 80 coding languages, including Python, Java, etc. That's where the performance of this model really does shine. If we go down to the performance of the model itself, and we look at some of the coding benchmarks here, we can take a look at the human eval benchmark. It outperforms even Claude 3.5 Sonnet, which a ton of people love as a model for coding answers. And in terms of the MMLU, it has a score of 84%. Now, the big thing with this model is it's only a N23 billion parameter model. It's still a really large model. You're not gonna be able to run this on like any consumer hardware. You will have to have specialized hardware for this. So it's designed for a single node inference, just like I had mentioned. So its size of 123 billion parameters allows you to run the large throughput on a single node. Now, the one thing to know with this model is that it's released under their research license. This allows you for usage and modification for research and non-commercial uses. If you do want to use the model for commercial purposes, you are able to self-deploy it and you can get a license by contacting them. Now, if we go back to the benchmarks, this is going to be a model that's going to be really strong at coding. You can see all of the different languages here. So when you compare it to even GPT-40 or Llama 3, it does outperform even the 405 billion parameter model across a ton of different benchmarks here. You can see here that it basically outperforms Llama 3.1 405 across the board with the exception of Bash. When you compare the model to GP40, it comes within striking distance of most of these metrics here, which you can see. And even on the Java score, it does outperform and it is best in class for Java. A few other things with the model is it has drastically improved performance for instruction following as well as conversation capabilities. So now if we look at the comparison to some of the different models here, we see that Mistral 2 large here it's right up there with some of these frontier models like Cloud 3.5 Sonnet as well as GPT-4.0. Like I mentioned, this model is trained on a diverse set of languages. You can see the ranking of the different languages here. So when you compare it to other models, again, it is right up there in terms of performance. Now, the one thing to know with this model is it is quite a bit smaller than some of these models that it's being compared to. While we don't know the exact parameter count of something like GPT-4.0, or we do know that Llama 3.1 is a 4 and 5 billion parameter model. So to have this type of performance on a model that's about 30% the size goes without saying is very impressive. The big thing with this model is it does outperform all of the frontier models on function calling and tool use. So that's gonna be something that I think a lot of people will definitely find interesting with this model because not only does it have the general capabilities, when you compare it to GPT-4 or Cloud 3.5, we do see that the performance is best in class. In terms of the places where you can access the model, you can access it on a platform that they have here, which is available on their website. I'll put the link within the description of the video as well. And then the model is also going to be available on all of the major hyperscalers here. I encourage you to try out the model, see how it performs. I'm going to be trying it in a couple different applications that I have here. See how it performs. Try out the model. Let me know what you think. If you found this video useful, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, until the next one.